So here's my next uh, 928 project, guys. Uh, last night I spent a little time and I disassembled the Bilstein coilovers um, that I have. And you can see them all dismantled here on this table. Um, fairly straightforward to do, nothing uh, but, to, but to dismantle them. Really the, uh, the only thing that you have to be careful is the spring is slightly compressed. So I use my spring compressor, which you see right here, just to keep the spring from flying out across the driveway um, once that top hat is uh, removed and the bolt holding it in place is removed. But uh, actually these are 928 international lowering springs and I bought the this setup from another 928 owner. Uh, so I'm excited to actually uh, install it on the car and uh, see how uh, the car drives and how, how much lower it is and how stiff it is. I believe these springs are fairly stiff and I'm not sure if uh, they're still offered by 928 International. I have to call them and uh, ask a, a couple questions on the spring ratings and so on. So uh, anyway, this these are the, you can see the, well, um, they have uh, the 928 International, you can see right here, their stamp and a part number. And uh, there, you can see they're actually a bit shorter than the stock spring. So I'm not gonna do anything to the spring, just gonna clean them up. Everything is in really good shape, but on the actual uh, struts slash shocks, I'm gonna just go through and clean these guys up um, and I get them looking good again. All the rubber for the mounts are in really good condition, which leads me to believe they're very, very low mileage. On my car, the rubber is starting to split and you can see they're deteriorating and on this this side they're in really good shape so um it'll be good to put put all new this all this setup in the car and renew what i have on mine on this stuff over here all the steel parts like the hats uh, the washers the threaded collars i'm actually going to powder coat everything you see that's steel and aluminum and, uh, and that way everything looks good. You can see these lower spring perches are uh, fairly rusty. They're in good shape, but they need to be sandblasted and powder coated and that way they'll be um, good for many, many years to come. And I probably, th these uh, mounts are rubber and I'll just clean them up and make them look good again. So not gonna do anything with this really, just, just kind of clean them up here at home, same with the Bilsteins. So the metal pieces here that you see um, will be powder coated and I'll get them back in probably a couple weeks and then I'll shoot another video with everything back and then assembled and then next thing you know we'll be putting them on the car so looking forward to doing that and uh, stay tuned for that video. Talk to you then. Take care. Bye.